okay so let's look at the atomic structure and um, please if this is the first time on this channel please subscribe and also hit the notification bell so that anytime we post a video you'll be the first person to get it okay so let's quickly move on um now we have a question here an atom is as mass number of 35 atomic number of 17 and you have to determine the number of neutron in the atom and also draw the electronic configuration of the atom but before that let's look at some few things now if you have an element is the top here is the mass number and down here is there's the atomic number atomic number the mass number is also called the superscript the superscript and this is the subscript the subscript the superscript is the superscript which is the the mass number is represented by the letter a and the atomic number which is the subscript is represented by the letter z now the mass number here the mass number here is just the sum the sum of protons or the electrons and neutron and neutron in the nucleus of the atom okay so atomic number atomic number is just the number of protons it's just the number of proton is the number of proton or electron is the number of proton or electron okay so basically that's what we have now mathematically so mathematically we have our mass number our mass number which is represented by the letter a is just the number of proton plus so the sum of and the, and the neutron and atomic number here atomic number here is just the number of proton just the number of proton now the question here is saying that um we should um we should um, determine the number of neutron in the atom so from the mass number we have the neutron here so quickly we can make neutron the subject here so we have a b equal to b plus n so making n the subject here then we can have um, something like here uh, a minus b equal to n a minus b equal to n so the neutron here b equal to a minus b so our neutron will be and we know um our um our um the number of the mass number is yes uh, 35 so we have our a to be 35 and, we, uh, and then atomic number here the atomic number here is just 17 so as you said over here the atomic number is just the number of proton so the proton here the proton here is just the same as the atomic number is equal to the atomic number so therefore our p here will be will also be uh, our proton will also be 17 so the number of uh, neutron here is just uh, a which is 35 here minus the number of proton which is 17 and we can have um, our answer to be 18 so the neutron number here is just 18 so we have 18 to be the number of neutron we have 18 to be the number of neutron now the question say we have to draw the the question we want to say we should um we should um draw the electronic configuration of the atom now the electronic configuration so we have the electronic configuration the electronic configuration is just um, arranging the number of electrons in the shell so um and it depends on so it depends depends on the number of protons the number of protons now from here we said the number of proton the proton here is 17 and we know the 17th element is just chlorine chlorine which is cl17 so therefore during the electronic configuration we can write chlorine as um, and the first shell always takes a maximum of two 
the subsequent shell that continues takes a maximum of 8 so we have 8 here now 8 plus 2 is 10 so what is left here is 7 what is left here is 7 so during the electronic configuration of the atom is yes, um you have your first shell here your first shell here to be 2 our second shell here to be 8 so on each of the sides and our last shell here to be 7 so 2 here 2 here 2 here and also 1 so quickly this is what we have and the element here is just chlorine so basically that's what we have um, for the solution and we are done with everything so our um, number of neutron here is just 18 during the electronic configuration we had um, a total of um, so this is the whole thing so we are done with everything so thank you very much and make sure you, you subscribe to the channel okay